Ave Maria, good afternoon, good evening. So welcome again to our Franciscan Vesper. This is your host, Father Johannes Jeremy of Cato Pinoy. So if you have your bravery like this or digital, you can pray with me. And again, in advance, I ask uh, forgiveness for some uh, noise, no barking of the dog because we are praying this Vesper here inside my room, inside the convent. And let us start uh, this Vesper uh, through the, uh, the prayer of invocation of St. Bonaventure. Lord, open my lips to praise your holy name. Cleanse my heart from many wordless, evil, distracting thoughts. Give me the wisdom and love necessary to pray this office with attention, reverence, and devotion. Father, let my prayer be heard in your presence. For it is offered through Christ our Lord. Amen. O God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be. World without end. Amen. Alleluia. We who once were dead, now live fully knowing, Jesus as our head, life is overflowing when he breaks the bread. We were lost in night, but you sought and found us, give us strength to find. Death is all around us, Jesus be our light. He became our bread. Jesus died to save us. On Him we are fed. Eating what He gave us. Rising from the dead. Let us share the pain. You endured in dying. We shall then remain. Leaving death defying, we shall rise again. Jesus, you were dead, but you rose and living, made yourself our bread. In your goodness giving, life though we were dead. So, our antiphon is taken from the pop from the proper of fourth Sunday of Easter and our psalms will be taken from the week for Sunday. First Antipon, seek the things that are done that are above where Christ is seated at God's right hand. Alleluia. From Psalm 110, the Lord's revelation, the Lord's revelation to my master, sit on my right. Your foes I will put beneath your feet. The Lord will wield from Zion, your scepter of power. Rule in the midst of all your foes. A prince from the day of your birth, on the holy mountains, from the womb before the dawn, I begot you. The Lord has sworn an oath he will not change. You are a priest forever, a priest like Melchizedek of old. The master standing at your right hand will shatter kings in the day of his great wrath. He shall drink from the he shall drink from the stream by the wayside, and therefore he shall lift up his head. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. First Antiphon. Seek the things that are above, where Christ is seated at God's right hand. Alleluia. Second Antiphon. In the darkness he dawns, a light, a light for the upright hearts. Alleluia. From Psalm 112. Happy the man who fears the Lord, who takes delight in all his commands. His sons will be powerful on earth. The children of the upright are blessed. Riches and wealth are in his house. His justice stands firm forever. He is light in the darkness for the upright. 
He is generous, merciful, and just. The good man takes pity and lends. He conducts his affairs with honor. The just man will never waver. He will be remembered forever. He has no fear of evil news. With a firm heart, he trusts in the Lord. With a steadfast heart, he will not fear. He will see the downfall of his foes. Open-handed, he gives to the poor. His justice stands firm forever. His head will be raised in glory. The wicked man sees and is angry, grinds his teeth and fades away. The desire of the wicked leads to doom. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Second Antiphon In the darkness he dawns, a light, a light for the upright hearts. Alleluia. Third Antiphon Alleluia, salvation, glory, and power to our God. Alleluia. From the Canticle of Revelation, chapter 19, verse 1 to 7. Alleluia, salvation, glory, and power to our God. His judgments are honest and true. Alleluia. Alleluia, sing praise to our God, all you his servants, all who worship him reverently, great and small. Alleluia. Alleluia, the Lord our all-powerful God is King. Let us rejoice, sing praise, and give Him glory. Alleluia. Alleluia, the wedding feast of the Lamb has begun, and His bride is prepared to welcome Him. Alleluia. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Third Antiphon, Alleluia, Salvation, Glory and Power to our God, Alleluia. Our, read, our reading is taken from the letter to the Hebrews, chapter 10, verse 12 to 14. Jesus offered one sacrifice for sins and took his seat forever at the right hand of God. Now he waits until his enemies are placed beneath his feet. By one offering he has forever perfected those who are being sanctified. Responsory, the Lord is risen, Alleluia, Alleluia. Repeat, the Lord is risen, Alleluia, Alleluia. He has appeared to Simon, responds, Alleluia, Alleluia. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, responds, the Lord is risen. Alleluia, alleluia. Canticle of Mary. My sheep will hear my voice. I, their Lord, know them. Alleluia. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is His name. He has mercy on those who fear Him in every generation. He has shown the strength of His arm. He has scattered the proud in the conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones, and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, 
As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Canticle of Mary, my sheep will hear my voice. I, their Lord, know them. Alleluia. Intercession, God the Father raised Christ from the dead and exalted him at, at his right hand. Let us pray to the Father, saying, Response through Christ in glory, watch over your people, Lord. Righteous Father, you lifted you lifted Jesus above the earth through the triumph of the cross. Response May all things be lifted up in him. Through your Son in glory send the Holy Spirit upon the church. Response that it may be the sacrament of unity for the whole human race. You have brought a new family into being through water and the Holy Spirit. Response, keep them faithful to their baptism and bring them to everlasting life. Through your exalted Son, help those in distress, free those in captivity, heal the sick. Response, and by your blessings, give joy to the world. You nourish our deceased brothers and sisters with the body and blood of the risen Christ. Response, raise them up at the last day. So right now, my brothers and sisters, let us include in our prayers our family, friends, loved ones, and also let us include our frontliners, our brothers and sisters affected by this pandemic coronavirus. And today also is Sunday of the Good Shepherd. Let us pray for all our shepherd, for all the priest, bishop, Catholic priest, bishop, and our Holy Father, Pope Francis. And also, today is also World Day of the Prayer for Vocation. Let us include in this Vesper to pray for vocation for the priesthood and religious life. Now, let us pause a moment of silence for our own personal intention. Now let us pray together the prayer our Lord Jesus Christ taught us. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Almighty and ever-living God, give us new strength from the courage of Christ our Shepherd and lead us to join the saints in heaven where he lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, your family, friends, and loved ones in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. So thanks again for praying with me. And remember, smile, be happy. Mama Mary loves you. Ave Maria.